Guys, how are we all doing today? I hope you guys are doing very well. So in today's hunt, we're going to be doing a 30 PED hunt, and I've decided, you know, I'm, I'm going to try to be a little bit more level appropriate with my guns, mainly to see what happens. So we got these, you know, little level 7s. It's probably going to seem be some higher level ones around here, but I haven't hunted these guys in ages. I found them and I just haven't bothered hunting them. So we're going to be using our LR10 and we got just a, you know, an easy 30 PED hunt. So we seem to kill these guys, you know, pretty damn easily. And they don't seem to hit me like at all. So this should be a pretty damn easy hunt, all things considered. Oh, and they drop sockets and stuff. You know what? We have extra stuff in here that I wasn't expecting. <laughs> So this is why you should always double check, um, this is why you should always double check what you have in your stuff. So you know what, we're just going to convert that. So we're going to have a 35 PED hunt instead. Off to a great start, Scott. Off to a great start. Always, already, already messing up. Let, let's just... <clears throat> Let's just dump this stuff in here. And we'll go with the socket as well. The socket get on there as well. We'll just dump that shit right in there. Alright, let's go out and hunt some of these guys. Yeah, <sighs> Time to get back to it. So yeah, I haven't hunted these guys in ages. I'm not even not even sure if I have <clears throat> A, uh, oh no, I do have a codex for them. I just haven't hunted them in, in quite a while. You know, we're going to track that. So, you know, an LR10, now I guess 35 PED run. So, hopefully, hopefully we get something good. Hopefully we get a good mix of loot. And, Ludius willing, a GD Global. Ooh, we got a level 16 cranking. <clears throat> so we are going to have some higher level guys, but the LR10 seems to work just fine. Yeah, LR10 seems to work just fine with these higher level dudes as well, so that's always a plus. Always a plus. Yeah, around 3.4. It's always good. I have a hunting challenge for these guys. Bloody since when? All right, I'm I'm gonna go and turn this in, and see if I get another one. And uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna pause, and then I'll just be back. Yeah, so it doesn't look like I'm actually gonna. It, yeah, it doesn't look like I'm gonna. Alright, so I've got all these that I just get to finish. Alright, cool. Very cool. What is with this game at the moment? What is... Ugh. Pain in the... Pain in the ass. Lagging and stuff. But I mean, you know, that happens. Need to get a new computer at some point. Maybe I should start a donation pool. Get Scotty C93 new computer. Nah. Not really my jam. <coughs> Got this bloody tickle in the back of my throat, so I'm hoping I'm hoping I'm not getting sick again. I bloody hope not. I really don't want to have to like go another you know, week without recording stuff. So, yeah, I'm going to be <laughs> recording a, a bunch of stuff today and a bunch of stuff tomorrow, just in case. Just in case. But, you know, even if I get sick, I'm probably still going to record stuff.
some sockets, some a mollusk tooth. Are these worth much? Mm, no, not really. Well, I mean, the sockets sell pretty well, but they're not really, <coughs> not really worth much. Not, not much in markup anyway. What's this? Another adult. So what will I get from the rewards for this one? Yeah, cool. Yeah, I think for this one I probably will get like the inflict range damage increase stuff. Because I mean, who doesn't want to do more damage? Well, okay, you won't do more damage, but it'll increase my skill level. Therefore, I'll hopefully be able to move on to the like, I, I want to be able to move on to the LR30 at some point and start using that. Because uh, one of the good things about leveling up your weapons is the higher the level of the weapon, especially with the LR series, the lower the markup. <coughs> Which is good. Means I'll have a little bit extra at the end of the week to, you know, to deal with stuff. Ooh, that's a... That's a big boy. Yeah, don't want to tangle with him. That's why you should always look before you start shooting. Because <clears throat> then you might... You might accidentally shoot something that you might not be able to handle. You know? And I'm not, I'm not particularly down for trying to, you know deal with something that is, you know, not really, uh, I mean, I could probably use the LR-25 to take him down, but, you know, he probably hits like a fucking truck, kind of like this guy. Just don't crit me, bro. Well, that was a pitiful loot from, from him. Absolutely pitiful. Yeah, there's a gatherer there. Go and shoot that guy. Hopefully, hopefully we get something good. I mean, I would like a global. A global would be nice. You know, especially if it's, you know, the f in, in the 50 PED plus range. That'd be nice, but I ain't gonna hold my breath. <laughs> I ain't gonna hold my breath for that. I reckon if I get a global, it's probably gonna be around 15, 20 PED. Max. That's my bet. If I was a betting man, that's what I would bet. Anyway. But it looks like we made back around a quarter of what we've put in so far. And we've maybe got, you know, maybe a quarter left. Sorry, not a quarter left, two quarters left. So, no, not a quarter, a third. Math, Scott. Math. We've gone through about one third, and we've gained back about one third. Thereabouts. I swear, one of these days... Math is going to be the death of me. You know, I'll be looking at like I don't know one of one of those uh, one of those laxative things, and I'm like uh, I only take a quarter of a tablet, otherwise it might you know make you shit out your insights. And I'm like, oh, a quarter. And then I take a third, and then you know, then I shit out my insights. It's going to happen. You know what? I. I wonder. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna shoot this guy a little bit, but I'm gonna be moving back. Right? There we go. <laughs> 43. So he wouldn't even, he wouldn't have even globaled even if I wanted him to. Then again, I'm not sure how much uh, the, I'm not sure if you like drag it to the turret if it will, um, uh, you know, cancel out any sort of globally stuff. I don't know. 
I don't know, man. But I guess that's one way to take care of, like, a, a, a slightly higher level annoying guy that might be in your way. Just drag him over to a turret. And the fact that now, after you shoot them a little bit, it, it actually does give you, like, back some of what you, um, you know, it does give back some of what you put in to, like, you know, shooting it. Makes it a little bit easier to, you know, like, shoot and then drag that sucker back over to the turret. Makes it a little bit, a little bit easier. I wonder if that means, like, if you're sweat gathering while you're in armor. Because I know, like, if it, things do damage to your armor and you drag them back to a turret... It, uh, gets rid of, you, you, you know, you, you get back a percentage of what was put in through the armor. So I'm wondering, if you do sweat gathering while you're in armor, one, does it increase the amount of skills that you have, you know, due to being in armor? And two, do you think you would be able to do, like, a solo sweat run a little bit easier? Questions for another day, I think. Things to check out. So we've got socket 2, socket 1, animal eye oil, second rate cloth extractor, mollusk tooth, animal hide, and your goody, goody, good old shratty. Come on, come on, don't, don't, don't be a douchebag, don't be a douchebag. You got this, man. You got this. So we gotta get around... You know, we gotta, we gotta get around 20 PED. Like, like, 20 more PED to sort of break even. <clears throat> I mean, I don't like my chances. Hmm, I could bust out the LR25 to go after that guy. Nah. I'll leave him be. Let's see. Yeah, you know, I just don't want to, like, get into the thick of it and then be surrounded by, like... Level 19s. I mean, I know, you know, there's no real cost in dying now, which is like, there's never been any cost in dying. There's no real um, cost in dying. So if I was to die now, you know, I'd just end up back at the revive point. <clears throat> but it looks like the higher level dudes are like few and far between. Like, we got. We had that level 26 and we got that level 19 up there. We got level 19 there. 12. 9. So, you know, not nothing, nothing too major. Nothing too strenuous. I mean, if we do get into a pinch, we could always bust out the LR25. And knock off some of these, you know, knock off that guy, for instance. What we'll probably do is just start heading back and knock off some of these guys as we go. <clears throat> How are my skills going? Range laser damage. Only got a little tiny bit so far. I'm gonna have to do like a. I'm gonna have to do like a lot of hunting, a, a lot of hunting, if I want to try to get that, you know, up up to up to scratch. If I want to get that up to level thirty, so I can start using an LR thirty. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna have to either do a lot more hunting, or start working on my pistol, 
skills to try to get that up. I don't know. What it, What is my pistol skills looking like? Where is my... So my laser pistol is at level 19, so I could switch at some point to the pistol and try to get that up to the, the hit up to 30, and that should bring my damage. You know, by the time I get that up to 30, I should theoretically, possibly, I better have my uh, range laser damage up to um, up to 30. A little bit further, hopefully as well. That would be good. So what I might do is I might end up getting a pistol and uh, I don't know, use up some PED, use, them, use up some stuff, maybe drop 10 bucks into the game, get some ammo, destroy it, like, cycle through all the ammo, then cycle through all the shrapnels and just keep doing that, then sell the loot, then just keep doing that, just to get the levels up, you know, it could work. It could, it, it could hypothetically, you know, I say hypothetically, it would most certainly work. You know, getting all them levels up. And if I get like, uh, a, like what, like a ten dollar starter pack or some, like a ten dollar refill, like starter pack refill. I'll even get those like skill boost pills. So that could that could always uh, come in handy. <clears throat> hmm. Level nineteen. You know. You know what? Yeah. Let, let's let's switch over to the LR twenty five, and see what we do. We're doing nuff, nuff, no, no, we're doing alright. We could, we could make this work. As long as he doesn't crit us do it and do a shitload of damage to us. We should be fine. Yeah. But we'll switch back to the LR-10. <laughs> Just to finish off the, the hunt. Where, where are we standing? Uh, we're standing at like... I don't know, like 20... We're probably looking at like 22, 23 PED, something like that. So we've most certainly taken a, taken a loss here. So I probably won't do another hunt here. I'll probably, uh, figure out what's been, you know, what's been, you know, what's been going, what's been doing what it do, and then, uh, go and hunt there. Might even try a hunt down at Boraz. Maybe. Yeah, do a little, little hunt down at Boraz, and hopefully, hopefully, uh, get a global off of them. But, you never know. I mean, we'll get a better idea of how much I actually lost once we get back to the, you know, once we get back to it, like to the, what is it called? The trade terminal. Once we get back to the trade terminal, we'll have a better indication of just how much I've boned myself. Okay, that guy I can't even click on. Another level seven. Uh, and you know what, I don't even think we're gonna, yeah, yeah, we're gonna call it there, because yeah, I don't think, I don't think I'm gonna get much glory here, like, at all. Yeah, we're not gonna be getting much glory today. So, let, let, let's see if we can get a rough guesstimate, I reckon maybe, we might be close to the 30 PED mark. Maybe 28. It may, yeah, maybe 28. That, 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 that would be, you know, if I, if I was a guessing man, that would be my thought. But let's have a, let's have a look. 29. Okay, so nearly 30 PD. So we're, 
Um, like if we were to add in the decay, which I don't, um, then, you know, we'd be down a little bit more, but since I don't add the decay into this, cause I take it out of my ped flow, uh, we're only down by about five PED. So not, not the worst position to be in. You know, I could probably get another, like if I was to hunt around here, I could probably get, I could probably squeeze like another five hunts out of this area, five or six little hunts out of this area if I wanted to. But I'm probably going to end up going um, either to Borez or up to, yeah, I'm either going to go to Borez or I'm going to go to Fort Lahar. But I'm thinking going to Borez and hunting uh, some of the, um, uh, but then again, there's, there's Kerberos down at, um, down at, um, Fort, uh, Fort Lahar as well. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, one of you guys wanted me to do a, like a very, very low level mining run. And I have thought about doing a, um, series based on low level stuff. Um, mainly so people who have just started can get a rough idea of what to expect from the low level stuff. And it works because when it comes to mining, I am pretty low level. I am, I am a low level miner because I do not have, um, mining is just hasn't, it, it was one of those things that I wanted to do quite a bit, but it's also one of those things where, um, yeah, yeah, see? You know, my highest mining skill is six. You know. You know, it's, that's, that's the highest level, it's six. Um, but, you know, I wanted, to, I wanted to do mining and all that sort of stuff, but if I was to do mining, right, I get maybe... Uh, I get maybe 10 PED from... Yeah, I get maybe 10 PED... A week from my ped flow and my um uh you know from all of the stuff that i get in so if i wanted to mine i could do low level just fine but if i wanted to say do any higher level stuff for recordings then you know i'd just be completely out of luck because i would have to use you know more stuff but you know problems for a different day problems for a different time Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, you know, you know, you, you know what to do. I'm going to have, um, uh, hopefully this week we'll be back to, you know, business as usual. Uh, that's sort of the hope anyway. Going to have some Entropy Universe stuff, going to have some Torchlight stuff, and, uh, possibly even some, uh, Dead Frontier 2 stuff. I'm going to be looking at doing, you know, a Dead Frontier 2 sort of thing starting you know fresh character and uh then exploring and seeing what's what so if that's something you guys would like to see let me know if not then don't watch it <laughs> simple anyway i hope everyone is safe and well this coronavirus stuff is going spastic absolutely freaking spastic so hope everyone's safe hope everyone's healthy and i will see you guys in the next one